Hey, assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome back to ICP. ICP is one of my eldest son and it's one of my babies. So let's talk about it because uh, it has been a while. I haven't talked about ICP and why not? Let's do it. So reaccumulation, okay? I've always pointed the arrow that whatever is happening with ICP right over here is nothing more than a phase called reaccumulation. Understand that uh, when it comes down to the word accumulation, I've always been a big fan of ICP in accumulation because ICP has one of the best accumulations that I've ever seen in the whole crypto. When you zoom out like this, look, the accumulation, trust me, started way back at $37. So in the future, I think ICP moving up to $35, $30, $40 is an easy peasy kind of a job. In my uh, opinion, of course, yours can actually be different. But I actually think that, you know, since the accumulation actually started from $33, uh, we are bound to supposedly see ICP eventually getting back up to that $33 department. Now, we have, however, probably failed to break above one place. And that is a little bit uh, bad because if you look at this little bit of support and resistance that we saw, you have this one touch and a move to the downside, another touch, a move to the downside, another rejection, move to the downside, and then you also made a fake out and you went inside and you still break, uh, failed to do something like this where you go to the upside, okay? That is really, really uh, bad, or, or honestly, it's going, I'm going to say that is really bad. It's not something good, you don't see that. And the next thing is that, at least now that we have this upper trend line coming in, we also have a lower trend line that is printing out probably something like this, okay? And slowly but surely, we will have the most maximum time. If you really have to stretch the time, it should not take you until 16th of July to do something about ICP because ICP has been boring. And I'm trying to see how, how longer is it going to be boring? How much long are we going to have to wait for it, ICP to do something? So I think... ICP here uh, has that upper resistance and then you have this lower support coming up which you have touch here, move up, touch there, move up. So it does look like this is an amazing entry opportunity because that is actually literally your support right now. So can $11.8 be another good opportunity? Probably it is actually a good opportunity. Even though your trend line looks like this, but your trend line can be tweaked also to look something like this as well okay even this is actually pretty valid and if you see um icp may be coming down to even uh 10.4 dollars that will still be okay so this trend line is a little bit of a concern because it actually does look like this and it will be, it would not be wrong to say that is actually like this as well so yeah whatever but you get the point okay let's just say it's a big big area and we can actually mark that area using a rectangle so we're going to take a rectangle here and we can actually say that this is almost like a whole demand box right over here. So this whole big zone right there between 11.2 and 8.8 dollar .8 is always a safe zone for me because if you start to go down and lose it like this, that's when it's going to be wrong. Okay, if you if you understand here. So that's all for the video, and I'm going to see you the next one in the office.